With the tap of the brush, the swirl of some paint, Marcus Glenn is making music. I'm up to four and five in the morning when the, when the uh, creative juices hit you, you just, you can't sleep. Blending his background, soundtrack covers, and fine art together, Glenn evokes rhythm and blues with brush strokes. So it takes hours. And now the official Grammy artwork. And there, of course, in California, there are uh, billboards and uh, the tickets. They, uh, their telecast program booklet. But when Grammy officials first reached out, Glenn thought it was a joke, especially when his Park West Gallery boss called to deliver the good news. And you're playing with us, aren't you? He said, no, this is all true. This is a true story. Unbeknownst to Glenn, he already was using his paintbrush to climb to the top of the charts. Because my paintings are so musically inclined, uh, the Grammys, uh, they kind of saw my work about 10 years ago, and so they kind of been following my career. Over a period of four weeks and hundreds of hours, his poetic vision came to life. This particular project, I, I babied it. The swirls of uh, music that you can, you could almost feel the music spilling out of the uh, gramophone. Grammy officials told Glenn, have fun, do what you want, you've got creative license. But they told him one thing had to be front and center. And that's their uh, iconic gramophone. That's the focal point of the, uh, of the painting. And while the Grammy painting will be featured on all sorts of memorabilia, there's one one-of-a-kind piece of swag that will be only worn by his wife. I needed a purse, and I told Marcus, I don't know what I'm going to carry. He said, don't worry, I have something special for you. And then a few weeks later, he popped up with this purse. And you better believe that arm candy will be worn as the duo meet their favorite artists. I'm looking forward to uh, meeting Jay-Z. I mean, I'm a big fan of his and, of course, Justin Timberlake. Glenn says he's excited to meet musicians from all across the audio spectrum, all while letting his paintings true colors shine through. To portray that music is the uh, universal language. And so uh, whether it's uh, Afro-Cuban jazz or R&B country, you can feel the music if it comes from the soul. Katherine Larson, CBS News, Detroit.